Today on Horseland, the failure to tame a dangerous horse causes Sarah to lose faith in herself. Here's a horse that really needs me and I can't seem to help him. The horse may be lost forever. If I can't show results by tomorrow, he's out of here. Hey, what's this? I believe it's called a video camera, Angora. Humans use it too. What it is, Shep. The question is, why is it here? I've got it! They're going to make a movie about me! A movie about you, Angora? How do you know? Well, who else would they make a movie of? Certainly not you. You are a pig. <gasps> Whereas I, my dear, am a cat. <sighs> and your point is... Cats are intrinsically interesting. No matter what they do, they do it with the utmost feline grace and... Yeah! Oh. Sometimes there's such a thing as having too much self-confidence. But that's not the case with Sarah. Hey, Alma. What you doing? Grooming. I've heard of air guitar, and I've heard of hair grooming, but air grooming? Sorry, Button. Hi, guys. Well, look what the horse dragged in. Que pasa, Molly? What's this new passion for fashion? Tell all. Alma, are you trying to tell me I don't look this nice every day? Just kidding. You're right. Today is special. I'm making a demo tape for the Horse Life Channel Junior Reporter Audition. Oh, that's right. Meet Molly Washington, roving reporter to be. Live from Horseland. That's gonna be our gig. Your gig? We're gonna try out for it too. Yeah, we just haven't gotten around to it yet. Come on, Molly, let's roll tape. This is exciting. What are you going to talk about? Sarah, of course. Not every stable has its very own horse whisperer. What's so special about Sarah? Anybody could do what she does. You think anyone could do what Sarah does? You wish. Yeah, Zoe. What about the time Sarah helped Pepper when she hurt herself on that jump, huh? See, si. and Chloe, what about the... Yeah! So, Sarah has a talent, does she? Can she understand Angora? Is she a cat whisperer too? Yeah, and how about that mouse? Can she mouse whisper too? Squeak, 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 Sarah. <laughs> <laughs> Why, Sarah, how nice to see you. We were just talking about you. Yeah, I heard every word. Squeak, squeak, Zoe. Oops. Oh. So you heard who your true friends are. Amigas para siempre. Yep. Friends forever. Darn right. Roll it, Bailey. Rolling and action. This is roving reporter Molly Washington. There are a lot of people in equitation that call themselves horse whisperers. And a lot of them are, well, phonies. I'm here today with Sarah Whitney, who's the real thing. Come on over here, Sarah. Wait, Sarah. Sarah, tell us what it's like to communicate with horses. Er, uh, well, that's not what I do. I mean, I don't talk to them in their language. I can't understand what they're saying, and I haven't a clue what they're thinking. But Sarah, I've seen you work miracles. I know you can do it. Uh, do what? Whisper to horses. I don't know what that means, Molly. I'm good with horses, but I don't have any mysterious talents, really. Cut. What's all the commotion out there? Hey, Sarah, give me a hand. Madison, what are you doing here? It's a long story. Calm down, Diablo. Here, let me help. I've worked with a lot of difficult horses before. Come on, boy. This would be good footage. Get the camera, Bailey. Right. 
Oh, Diablo! Look, Sarah, he won't even let me touch him. Record everything, okay? Got it. Come on, Diablo. Look at me. That's better. Okay, Madison, let's get him into a stall. Sarah is now demonstrating how to deal with an upset horse by making eye contact and persuading him to yield to her control. That's good, boy. That's good. Almost there. What's going on? I don't know, but I think we're about to have a visitor. Yeah, an unwelcome one. There you go, boy. Don't worry. I'm going to give you time to settle down now. <laughs> Bailey! Get that thing out of here! You've seen it with your own eyes. A vicious, savage, out-of-control beast. Calmed and pacified by our very own Horseland Horse Whisperer, Sarah Whitney. She says she doesn't have any special talents. But as for me, I'm a believer. This is Molly Washington for the Horse Life Channel, live from Horseland. That's a wrap. Wow, you sound just like one of those Horse Life Channel reporters. Madison, why are you limping? It was all my fault. I tried a jump that was way too high. My folks agreed to board Diablo here for a few days. Will you work with him, Sarah? Please? Well, sure, but what exactly do you want me to do? Everyone knows you're a horse whisperer. Tell Diablo how much I love him. Make him like me again. Diablo was my very first horse ever. But if he won't let me ride him again, my folks are going to sell him. They're giving him a little time at Horseland, and that's it. You're his last chance. <sighs> I'll try, but no promises, Madison. No guarantees. Thanks, Sarah. I know you'll try. Bye, Sarah. Bye, Madison. So, What's your name, stranger? They call me Diablo. What's with you and my Sarah, Diablo? My owner knows her, that's all. But why are you here? None of your business. Hey, who do you think you are? Like I said, none of your business. Look, Madison is my neighbor. She rides at Stanhope Stables. I'm just trying to help her out, okay? Come on, Sarah. That horse is trouble. Yeah, snorting and nipping and kicking like that? He's mean. Do you know what the word Diablo means in English? Devil. Just what are you getting yourself into here, Sarah? All I know is I should help my friend. Hello, boy. I'm not going to hurt you. No one's going to hurt you. It's so interesting to watch Sarah at work. This horse Diablo is angry, mean, and smart. A real triple threat. To show you what I'm talking about, I'm going to join Sarah in the arena. I'll come with you. I'll be joined by Horseland's finest rider and top equestrian researcher, Alma Rodriguez. Come on, Alma. Let's go meet Diablo. <laughs> That's good. Just look at me. You can trust me. Hey, Sarah. <laughs> Mind if we join you? Molly! I was on the verge of a breakthrough and you broke the spell. Oh, sorry. You said spell! I broke the spell? I knew there was something mystical about this. Tell us, Sarah, what's your secret? No, no, it was just a figure of speech. I'm here in the arena with Sarah Whitney. We're discussing the element of magic and the ancient art of horse whispering. It's not magic! Why are those two arguing, Chef? Huh? Well, Tina, Sarah wants to do it her way, and Alma thinks she knows what that way is, and Molly wants to make a video about it. Hmm. Molly's missing a golden opportunity. She could be making a video about me. Chloe, there's no chance Molly could get that junior reporter job with the Horse Life channel, is there? I don't think so. She doesn't take anything very seriously, and she has no sense of style whatsoever. 
But what if by some freak of nature she wins and we don't? I would just die of embarrassment. She'd be a celebrity and no one would pay any attention to us. Ugh, too horrible to think about. We've, We've got, got to, to do something. something. Morning, Diablo. Today, we're going to try something new. Those carrots look mighty good. And you'll look mighty bad if you eat one. They're not for you. Right. And you don't want to make Diablo mad at you, do you? Oh, no, 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 I don't. Why is he so mean, champ? Well, he acts mean for sure. But I have a feeling that's just what it is, an act. Don't like the looks of that bridle, do you, boy? That accident you had must have really upset you. Looks delicious, doesn't it? Mmm, it is delicious. Want one? It's yours, but only if you take it out of my hand. Aw, that wasn't so bad, was it? Okay, okay. We'll get to that later. I'm not going to give up on you so easily, you know. Once again, Sarah's demonstrating the four main ingredients of horse whispering. Patience, perseverance, kindness, and a real affection for horses. You have to stop filming us for a while. It's really making Diablo nervous. Me too, for that matter. Okay, sure. No problem. Sure, Molly's good, but when they see us on her tape, they'll know who the real superstars are. Right, okay, here we go. So, tell us, Zoe, what's it like to own one of the most beautiful horses in the world? You mean, the most beautiful horse in the world? No, I mean one of the most beautiful horses in the world. But enough about you. <gasps> My turn. Are we gonna let them get away with this? No way. I've got an idea, but I'll need your help, both of you. Count me out. I never bite the hands that feed me. If Chloe and Zoe get away with this, they'll be way too busy being roving reporters to spend any quality time with you, Angora. Which means you could kiss your kitty treats goodbye. So what's the plan? Easy, Diablo, easy. You've had a bridle on before. That's it. No big thing. Just you and me, Diablo. Wow, she's doing it. I wish I were filming this. Me too, but a promise is a promise. No cameras until Sarah says so. Chloe Stilton reporting from Horseland Stables, where you're about to see the most beaut... Ah, ah, chow, a chow, ah, Zoe Stilton reporting from Horse... Er, uh, achoo. We're back at the... Hey! <gasps> Thanks a lot, Zoe. Watch where you're going. Uh, excuse me, but has either of you seen my... Uh, video camera? Give it up. Chloe made me do it. Easy, boy. Hmm. <laughs> Be still, Diablo. You let me get the bridle on you, but I need to go further. How can I help you if you won't let me? I'm just about ready to give up. Oh no, I forgot to turn off my cell phone. Hello? Oh, Madison, I'm so sorry. What, Sarah? What happened? They found a buyer for Diablo. 
That's terrible! Why would they sell Diablo before you're done working with him? Well, they haven't made the deal yet. But Madison's parents have given up on Diablo and they're anxious to move on. They said if I can't show results by tomorrow, he's out of here. You had to do something! I've tried, but maybe I've just been lucky so far. Here's a horse that really needs me and I can't seem to help him. Sarah, this is one of the toughest challenges you've ever faced. I think you need to take a break. Why don't you go for a trail ride? Maybe I'll take Scarlet out, just for a break. Wake up and smell the hayseeds, Diablo. Your days are numbered. If Sarah can't turn you around, you're going to lose Madison, the best owner you ever had. The only owner I ever had. And look what I did to her. She's hurt because of me. You mean all this is because of your jumping accident? Whoa, Dad. I've made mistakes too and Molly's fallen a few times. Molly's not limping. Madison is. What do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Stop it, Diablo. Running away isn't the answer. Find someone else to lecture, dog. I'm out of here. Oh, boy. I'm getting help. Diablo! Come back! We have to go after him! Bring your camera! Oh, Scarlet. I still don't know what I should do to help Diablo. Diablo! He's running away! After him, Scarlet! He went through there, Scarlet! to climb out of here and get Bailey's folks to help us. Be good, okay? I'll be back as soon as I can. <laughs> well, look who's here. I don't know what your problem is, Diablo, but I've been doing my best to try to help you, and now I need you to help me. I'll tell you what you're going to do. You're going to let me get on your back. Then we're going to ride out of here and get help. <laughs> I'm not taking no for an answer. You have to do this, Diablo. For Scarlet and for me. Most of all, for you and Madison. <laughs> See? That's not so bad. Now I'm going to put my hands on your back and pull myself up. Okay, here goes. That's good, Diablo. That's good. Scarlet, I'll be back soon. Just stay there and, and don't, don't panic. panic. Help, Help is on the way. way. Ready? <laughs> good. Let's go. Camera! Sarah's riding Diablo! And so, because of her patience and perseverance, she and Diablo got help to free Scarlet. Sarah found her way with horses again, and Diablo went back to his owner, Madison, and they all rode happily ever after. Way to go! Good job, Molly! Thank you! Now I have some big news to tell you. The Horse Life Channel loved my piece! They want me to be their new junior reporter. Why, Molly, that's great. You did it. When do you start? I don't. I turned them down. You, you what? what? The job wouldn't have left me any time for writing. And that's what's most important to me. 
Hey, Calypso! So are they going to show your piece? We worked so hard on that. Sorry, but I asked them not to, for Sarah's sake. Thank you. I don't want anyone out there thinking I'm some sort of horse whisperer. But thank goodness I still have a way with horses. Right, Scarlet? <laughs> you tell them, girl. <laughs> Good to see how a little patience and perseverance finally paid off and got Sarah believing in herself again. Right, Tinny? Right, Shep. I didn't want to show this in front of Chloe and Zoe. Check it out. Chloe Stilton reporting from Horseland Stables where you're about to see the most beautiful... Uh, uh, so we still Tim reporting from horse... Uh, achoo. We're back at the... Hey! <laughs> well, some folks, like Chloe and Zoe and Angora, have no shortage of self-confidence, whether it's deserved or not. <laughs> Others, like Sarah, need their confidence restored once in a while. How about you?